Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. When we first came here to Maine, there were just no, there were no art galleries in this area. Anyhow, there might. There were a few frame shops in Portland that showed art, but there was, there were no real galleries. That was a nice gallery. Adolf, my husband, was working, running the main art gallery for about three years, and we, the Harlow Gallery was sort of in our radius. I remember I had a show there with Gina Burris, two-man show that was very nice. He had a hard time hanging, driving hangers into those brick walls. Though. And I can't remember who, who the director was or anything about it much, but uh, I remember the shows and, uh, and the gallery. It, we, it was fixed up at, at the time. It had been remodeled. And it was very, very nice gallery. I think I remember he uh, showed, uh, it was called The Future Generation. It was a car must have been a bronze or bronze. I don't think it would have been a stone carving because it was about that big, and it was a father reclining with a child, and I remember that was there in the in the gallery window. So that's that must be one he showed there. And they went to Grenada. And they traveled quite a bit, and he and they and my mother would make sketches, and she'd paint when she got home. I remember they had several pictures of Grenada. My son still has one. It's about just a plain volcano and not very appealing. <laughs> just the cone of the volcano. It's tricky to keep a gallery going, but Hallowell sort of a... I always liked Hallowell because of the antique shops, too. I'd go to the gallery and then I'd run around the antique shops. But the Wiscasset Art Gallery just kept going. It's amazing. And I'm amazing that the Harlow Gallery has kept going.